Hey, I'm Kristen Balboni and I'm here to take you through some numbers that could help you in fantasy this week. Cordero Patterson is currently ranked 16th among wide receivers in this week's rankings. Using five words or less, we want you to tweet us at Mike and Mike using the hashtag MM five words. We have some of your responses here. Let's give a decision once and for all. True or false, the Browns made the correct decision at quarterback. And who is more to blame for the Cowboys' horrific defense? I added the word horrific. Monty Kiffin or the players? Players. Okay, this story made me laugh. What do you guys think about Texas A&M quarterback Kenny Hill attempting to copyright the nickname Kenny Trill after starting a whopping two games? And by the way, did he give himself that nickname? I think, okay, so we the need to story, find that out the story because... was from Darren Ravel, and it kind of made it sound like he gave himself. Wow. He, per, he said he preferred to be called Kenny Trill. You're, you're, that's a complete no-no. You, can't, no, no. you, give you can't give a yourself a nickname. All right, they were flying in. Peter wants to know, Darius, will we be seeing a blowfish reunion anytime soon? Yes, I don't know if soon, but in a, in a year or two, we, we've been talking about getting back together. I think I got another country record I'll do, and then we'll do a quick year of hooting the blowfish, so yes. That's Ooh, awesome. Nice. There you oh. go. Adam tweets in, do the Dolphins still make you cry, Darius? After the 1-15 in 15 season, I decided <laughs> to stop crying because that was a tough season, so not anymore. They're still my favorite team. I still, my blood still runneth aqua, but, the, you know, we lose too much. Got no Sean crying. Moreno, though. That was a uh, you know, we'll good pickup. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Was, we got to get somebody. Give me one word. The NFL suspension of Ray Rice is blank. Go ahead. You guys made a good point. Terrell Pryor got five games for exchanging memorabilia for free tattoos mm -hmm. um, in college. And then this is a two-game suspension. The brazil Colombia. I'm going to go with Colombia si. just because I know that's who. I, f I feel like people are really starting to get on their bandwagon, right? Oh, see, si. And, I, I and you want them to win. U.S. soccer players are playing to get a scholarship. Right. Whereas in, in Europe, they're playing to, to make a team at 18. Ryan, you said that Stephen A. is very particular about his food. Yeah. And, uh, Rosillo, you said that SVP likes half shirts. Around the house. <laughs> Around the house, of course, not in public. Oh, so man, now it's time shirts. for you guys to tell us one thing we don't know about the two of you. Mm. What kind you of got, secrets see, you got? I feel like on your face it's telling me you have yeah, something you, you want to share. Good. Okay, should Green Bay fans listen to Aaron Rodgers and just relax? You know, they yes. have been one and two a lot they, recently. They have. I did this. I, I relax a little bit and give a little more time, yes. I agree. I'd be relaxed if Aaron Rodgers was my quarterback. Like, sure, go ahead, handle that, this. That guy, he, he kind of, he knows how to land the plane. Yeah, Give absolutely. him the controls. Good stuff, nice Balboni. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Hey, I'm Kristen Balboni, and the theme of this week's Strength in Numbers is Don't Panic. The numbers say you should have patience with two running backs who have gotten off to slow starts this season. First up is Eddie Lacy. Now look, there's no denying that Lacy's performance so far has been disappointing. He hasn't scored more than five fantasy points in a game this season. Ouch. However, it should be noted that Lacy's first three games were versus three of the top four run defenses in the league. Tweet us at Mike and Mike your five words for your NFL team. Use the hashtag MM. Five words. And what's your five words for your Panthers? Doing I was, great. I was hoping you'd ask. I'd say one nine of last ten. Yes, I count on my fingers. Thanks for watching. You can follow me on Twitter at Kristen Balboni.